Someone asked me about the Beatitudes when we were on the Mount of Beatitudes. And this particular Bible explains it in a real simple way. The spiritual mountain climbing, eight upward steps in the divine life. The initial step is humility. That's a conscious need. Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. The second step is penitence, mourning for sin. Blessed are those who mourn, for they will be comforted. Third step, meekness, marking the birth of a new spirit. Blessed are the meek, for they will inherit the earth. Fourth step, spiritual appetite, signifying growth. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they will be filled. Fifth step, mercifulness, an attribute of God indicating further advance. Blessed are the merciful, for they will be shown mercy. The sixth step, heart purity, marking the attainment of higher attitudes, where comes the vision of God. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they will see God. Seventh step, peacemaking, a Christ-like influence calming the storm of life. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called sons of God. The eighth step, the summit. Blessed are those who are persecuted because of righteousness, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are you when people insult you, persecute you, and falsely say all kinds of evil against you because of me. As long as we're working in the Christ light, going towards that fulfillment, why do we care? how people judge us. The only way we can be on target would be to go to God, merge in that being, find your identity as a soul consciousness, as uh, one who is born in the Christ consciousness. Be